This is not your usual pizza uniform. Then again, this is not your usual pizzaiolo. Meet the U.S. pizza team's first ever health and fitness coach. Uh, my name is Matt McClellan and I am the owner of Tour de Pizza in St. Petersburg, Florida. I created the name and the logo and the recipes, everything here is my own. And uh, as you can see from the walls and the, the decor, I do a cycling themed, healthy triathlon pizza shop. Um, well, I moved here and every day I would see like groups of cyclists and packs like on Tour de France. And I knew the cycling and triathlons was big in Florida and uh, I wanted to bring that love here and, and have a positive, healthy, trendy uh, pizzeria here in Florida. Matt has his sights set much higher than just Florida. In August of 2009, Matt lost more than 24 pounds on a diet of his own invention, the 30-day pizza diet, a regimen that called for pizza, portion control, and moderate exercise. After multiple TV appearances, Matt took a bike tour up the East Coast that culminated in a gargantuan pizza party in Times Square. It's not a stretch to say Matt is a spokesman for health, fitness, and the American pie. We had this legislation out there that they're trying to impose an 18% tax on pizza and soda. They've, they've excluded us from all the other fast foods, including people's decisions on accountability for their own actions, and said that obesity in America is solely blamed on pizza and soda. And the pizza industry needed a spokesperson. They needed someone to stand up to the media and say, look, this is not, it's not right what you're doing. These, for some reason, because of the media, they've, they've categorized it as a junk food. And it's my job to change that image for you, for the pizza shop owner out there across America who's working every day. I'm your voice. With the help of PMQ Pizza Magazine, Matt taught himself the art of making pizza. But he wasn't content just to be a promotional machine. He decided to test his skills at the 2010 American Pizza Championship in Orlando, Florida. You know, I'm not a pizza man. I'm not, um, I didn't go to culinary school. I didn't grow up in the family business. I didn't. I don't come from a, uh, a family of, of pizza shop owners or um, Italian descent. A PMQ Magazine was a, a lifeline for me back five years ago when I started in this industry. I was waiting for your magazines to come every month, new recipes. I would go to the website and look at dough uh, secrets from the dough doctor. And Matt competed well in the pizza championships in Orlando, but did not take home the top prize. Pizza Radio's Andrew Abernathy caught up with Matt after uh, you know, the competition. I think most people know me from the creativity and the publicity side of what I do for the industry. Changing pizza from junk food to health food and the pizza diet and the bike ride in New York. Uh, but this is a chance for me to test my culinary skill against the best of the best. Turns out uh, it's an honor to be here and uh, this is definitely a new experience for me and, and one of my highlights of my career.